Teenager, you got a lot of parties on there. <laughs> you ready? You ready? You ready? You ready, you ready, you ready. Welcome to the Upside Down Smiley Show, where we talk about real life, but we don't take life too seriously. My name is Shereen, and today we're going to talk about parenting. Cue the intro. with my mom about parenting. She is a mother of four children. I am the third of the four. Um, and she's gonna talk to us about parenting and give us some advice and yeah, you ready mom? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what was it like having four kids? Uh, it is good but it's tough. Yeah, yeah. what was tough about it? Uh, especially with the teenagers. Yeah. Um, I was a tough teenager. <laughs> yeah, and um, uh, so it, it's hard, and especially Daddy was going to school and I was home at home. Mm -hmm. When home. like when Susan and Celine were little, right? Susan was small, yeah, mm -hmm. and I was going to school too. When they were small? Yeah. Was it? Do you feel like all four of us were tough teenagers? Um, uh, well, not too bad, but um. I think Luke was a little different, I think. Yeah, because he's a boy. Yeah. Yeah, so there's three girls and then one boy. Yeah. So how do you, like, different as in easier or cool. different as in harder? Luke. Luke. Luke was a little easier. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Although you, like, had accidents and random oh, yeah. things happen. Yeah. Do you recommend other people have four kids? Like, would you, do you think I could handle four children? I think you can handle it. Yeah? Yeah. Really? I thought you will be a good teacher. Mm. Yeah. Thanks, mom. <laughs> um, I feel like also, but you were a lot younger. Like you had your first child at 25. Yeah. And I'm 32. Mm -hmm. So if I start having kids, mm -hmm. I'm going to be 33 in January. Okay. So if I start having kids at 33, mm. that's a lot. Mm. Four kids starting at 33? Yeah, that's a little hard. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah, we are, you are, your parents are around, you know? True, both sides of my parents help, are around. Yeah, so they can help you. Yeah. And then you had your last child at 43? Yeah, 42. 42? Mm -hmm. What was that like? Uh, it was hard. Yeah, mm -hmm. how so? I was very tired. Yeah, I feel like I'm tired right now. Yeah, you put to my last, <laughs> last day of my shoes. So. <laughs> yeah, I, I used to tie her shoes yeah. when she was pregnant with my brother. I feel like also it was different because your kids are spread out. So mm -hmm. yeah, it's um, good to have kids closer. You think so? so yeah. Although so that will that way they grow up together mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. grow faster. But do you feel like it was helpful having older mm -hmm. kids because we were able to help? Yeah, right. But you prefer it to be closer. I prefer to closer and also the older kids should help them. Yeah, right, right, but what if they're too young to help? I mean, still the parents are around. Yeah. Yeah. But you you think having kids closer in age is better? Yeah, maybe two, two and a half years difference. Yeah, I guess so, but I guess other you... Way, the other way, we did a three set of kids actually. <laughs> three set. That is hard. Like one was Susan and Celine, Celine. like close to three age, and three and years old, three eight years, right? In two, between? Two and a half years. And then seven years later was me, and yeah. then six, six and a half years later was Luki. Mm -hmm. So yeah. But I feel like you don't know what it was. it would be like to have kids closer in age, right? So. I don't know if you yeah, it but, would be uh, easier. But I think they will play together, they will spend time together. Mm -hmm. What was it like um, raising me? Uh, raising you? I can't even remember. I think you were okay. <laughs> I was okay as a okay. child? Yeah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And then what about as a teenager? A teenager, you got a lot of parties on the <laughs> <laughs> I trust her, my kids. Uh, but they may made a lot of mistakes. Yeah, I feel like yeah. that's like yeah. inevitable to make mistakes. Right, right. that's um, the way they learn. Right, and I think yeah. I, I definitely did learn from my mistakes. I yeah. feel like when I did something wrong, yeah. and maybe it took a couple of times for things to go wrong, mm -hmm. for me to like understand the consequences and like what I was doing to other people and mm -hmm. whatnot. But eventually, as you mature and realize, like you know, it's not all about you and everything that you want is not mm -hmm. going to work out. It affects other people in like a harmful way, I think is what took me some time. What kinds of advice do you have for other parents or me yeah. one day? Okay. 
you kids are you have to watch your kids all the time you don't know who is playing with them mm -hmm. or what kind of uh, even cousins and everybody you know you have to watch each other yeah them because kids could make a lot of mistake mm -hmm. you know without knowing right just um, curiosity curiosity always close close um, attention you know mm -hmm. to the kids patience you need a lot of patience yeah and kids has to learn um, whatever they do uh, there's a consequence you know yeah and they made a mistake they have right. to and also respect the other people teach all the basic things to the kids when they are small you know? mm -hmm. yeah i feel like a, a lot of that i don't feel like you guys really talked about it but i mm -hmm. think it was through your actions yeah like you set good examples mm -hmm. and i think a lot of times people may say things mm -hmm. but then their exa their Very actions yeah, yeah don't reflect that same value that you're trying to teach your children mm -hmm. like if, if you tell your kids not to drink and not smoke but then you do that then like yeah that's not it, right it's not right mm -hmm. like how are you gonna like tell your kid to do something and it's wrong and you yeah. do it right. always always respect other people you know basic things that you had to teach the kids so. yeah and uh, there is a God there, we had to respect God and mm -hmm. God is giving us life and everything. So, you had to uh, teach that kids, you know. Yeah. Are you going to share this video with your friends on WhatsApp? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You, you watch my videos though, right? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Are you, have you caught up all the way? I don't know. Do you I just posted this? a video today. No, it's Every not. Monday. Okay. Alright, this is gonna come out next Monday. You gonna watch it? Okay, let me see. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching. Okay. I post up, post videos every single week, every single Monday, and yeah. Come out and hang out and we talk about real life. Okay. Thanks, Mom. Thank you. <laughs>